<laughs> and this is what it looks like. This, I can barely see it, but with the light of my phone, I can see it way better. What's going on guys? It's here, Eddie. In this video, I'm gonna continue the process to remove the wart forever. I still have the bandages on. Today is October the 16th, 2022. And today, I'm gonna continue to remove the bandages that are right on my index finger, right in front of you. <laughs> so I'm gonna continue this process until the wart is completely removed from my index finger. At the moment, I don't have any bandages to put on. I ran out, so I have to order more. For now, I'm just gonna go ahead and take off the bandages from my index finger and I'm gonna show you what the index finger looks like and what the wart looks like at the moment. I had these bandages on for a day and a half already. Let's get started on removing the bandages off my index finger. This is what the bandages look like for a day and a half. <laughs> Still sticking to the finger. I've been washing dishes, I took a shower with the bandages, and they are still sticking to the finger. So now, let's take the bandages off and see what my index finger looks like and what the wart looks like now. The regular bandage, it's still sticky. Bam. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Trying to find the end to the bandage. I found it, but it's really sticky. Bam. <laughs> The bandage is real sticky, and this is what the ward bandage looks like. Yucky. <laughs> Showtime. So you can see what my index finger looks like and what the wart looks like. Look how the skin is. Look around the wart. That is the wart right there. I'm gonna peel off the skin around the wart. Look, it's about to come off. There's the skin. <laughs> this is what the index finger looks like. I can barely feel the wart, but it's still there. I have to continue the process. Use light from my phone. And this is what it looks like. Like this, I can barely see it, but with the light of my phone, I can see it way better. The wart is touching the meat already. It's like so low, like I can barely feel it. But look how small it has gotten. It's touching the meat already. 
but definitely the wart bandage is working. That's what it looks like. But in a couple of more days or weeks, hopefully the whole wart will be removed completely. <laughs> this is it for now with this update. After taking the bandage off right in front of you and the way my index finger looks with the wart. Later, I'm going to give you another update regarding putting the bandages on again right in front of you. So let's continue the process. Hopefully soon this wart will be removed from my index finger. So let's continue the process. <laughs> What's going on guys, it's here, Eddie. I'm gonna continue with the process for the wart removal that is right on my index finger. I don't have any bandages on for the moment because I wear them for too long. I just decided to have my finger just, let my finger breathe for a while. I'm gonna show you what the wart looks like. So, let's do it. Showtime. This is what my index finger looks like and what the wart looks like. As you can see the color of the skin right around the wart. It has a different color. This is the way the bandages look. I have a wart bandage on and a regular bandage on. Even though the regular bandage is small, I'm gonna go ahead and put another one on. <laughs> And this is to keep the wart bandage on for a longer period of time. So let's get the papers off of this bandage. Look how small this bandage is. I ran out of the big bandages and this is all I have left. The small ones. I have to order more of the regular bandages to wear the big bandages. But for now, I have no choice but to wear this small bandage. So let's put it on. <laughs> this is to seal the war bandage and the other regular small bandage. I'm gonna go ahead and seal the whole finger. Boom. <laughs> this is what it looks like now. Look how cushioned my finger looks now. <laughs> Let's continue the process until this wart is completely removed forever. It's gonna take some time. It's gonna take a couple of more days or a couple of more weeks, but this wart will be removed forever soon. And you're gonna be seeing this. You're gonna see the updates. You're gonna be seeing how this wart is going to be removed forever. And you're gonna see this because I'm gonna continue the process right in front of you. You're gonna see the wart being removed forever soon. Not just because I wanna take it off from my index finger forever, but I also want for this to work on you. If you have a wart or warts, even if you don't have bandages, you know, all the time, continue the process, it will work. As long as you continue the process, because it takes time. Real things take time. This is real. This is a real wart that is right on my index finger. It's taking time, but the thing is that it's working and you're seeing it. You're seeing it. Even when I do other videos, you're seeing that I'm wearing the bandages, how the bandages are worn out. You're seeing it. So it's real. 
This is real, 100% real. Like I said, if you don't need to go to the doctor, you don't have to go to the doctor. But as long as you continue the process and this works, why not? Why spending so much money at the doctors when you can do it yourself? If this works that you're seeing right now, even if it takes time, then it works. You will save a lot of money. And this is the purpose of this video, that real things take time. Never give up. Just continue the process as I am doing. There's nothing easy, but you got to continue the process until it's done. You are going to see the wart coming off because I'm going to show you this right on the videos. If it worked for me, it can also work for you if you have warts. And they can also be removed if you continue the, with the process. <laughs> so let's continue the process. This is it for now. <laughs> See you in a while. <laughs>